ABS e Adventurers, this is my 100th video and it's going to be a Q&A. So let's get started with the questions. First one is, is my scorpion still alive? Well, of course it is. I have actually seen it outside its hiding spot a couple of times. What can be done to bring more focus on invertebrates and their conservation? Because all the limelight is given to the preservation of other animals. Well, you should take into consideration that there are a lot of species of invertebrates, many of which are not endangered. But in order to conserve them, my first thing is to get more people interested in them, explaining about how they are useful, how they are important to ecosystems, and how they are very cool. Why haven't I done a face review for so long? Well, I don't want all the limelight on me and it takes a lot of time and preparation to set up the camera, set up the lighting, stuff like that. So I find it easier to just do a voiceover. What is the most beautiful species of tarantula, scorpion, ant and centipede? In my opinion, the most beautiful tarantula is the electric blue tarantula because of their big legs. Scorpion, it will be the Florida bark scorpion because it's purplish and black. For the ant, it will be the metallic pony ant for its metallic green sheen. And for centipede, it will be those blue-legged centipedes. Can I show totals in my videos? I don't have totals in my collection yet. Can I show the full life cycle of a butterfly? First, I need to find some butterfly eggs or a caterpillar. And yeah, it will take a lot of time to film it, but I will do it. I will do it. Will I ever keep pet vertebrates? Yes, in the future, I shall do it. I'm planning to keep stuff like vine snakes, bearded dragons, turtles, frogs, and probably a flightless group of parrots. I don't know. What is my favorite insect? No doubt, the orchid mantis. What will happen if I force feed a carnivorous insect a plant? They will not eat it. First of all, you cannot force feed an insect. It's not easy to do so. And they will also realize they are not eating meat. What is my favorite video out of my large collection of 99 videos? Huh. Mostly the one about the mantis, can mantises catch computer bugs and the build video of the sheep and spiders enclosure. How do ants make formic acid? Ants basically have specialized glands in their mesosoma and gastro which help them do this. Formic acid basically is the spraying version of venom which helps incapacitate prey. What happens if a fire ant colony goes to war with a green tree ant colony? Who will win? Well, it depends on multiple factors because each ant has its advantages and disadvantages. Green tree ants, for example, are much larger. They are probably smarter. They have better vision and they spray formic acid, which means they can attack over a distance. Fire ants have more numbers. They are more aggressive and they have stronger venom. So it depends on multiple factors. And the last question is, what is the future of ABSE? First of all, I want to increase my subscribers. I'm currently working on a secret project as well as a ton of projects which will come in the future. I want to have bigger projects, a new simplified logo, more animals, a better animal room in the future in like 10 or so years. I want to do some more experimenting with videos, make them better quality and do a lot more stuff. So that concludes our 100th video. A big thank you to everyone for watching my videos. Anyway, if you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and goodbye.